All right, thank you, Brianna. Well, the Puffer Valley Trail, considered to be one of the city's jewels today, the city announced that trail is going to expand. Fox 55's Avery Johnson is live for us right now at Coliseum with more about where this new trail is going to go. Well, Brian, this is actually going to be a brand new pedestrian bridge that will go over right over my head where I'm standing and then cross over what is a very, very busy intersection of Coliseum Boulevard. Construction is expected to begin as early as 2026. Now, if you take a look on your screen, you can see the red is exactly where you will see that bridge go on the west side of Bob Thomas Ford and Mission Barbecue on the south side. City officials tell me over 37,000 cars travel on Coliseum Boulevard daily. And right now you can see some of those renderings on your screen of what that bridge is supposed to look like. And as of right now, there's no way for pedestrians and cyclists to safely cross. Greenways manager Don Ritchie says this expansion is vital to connect bikers and pedestrians to over 600 businesses safely. Once this bridge is complete, it will connect 130 miles of existing trails in our network. Basically, our northern trail system is disconnected currently from the rest of our trail network through downtown and Avoid Township and New Haven. So this will provide that connection. The Puffer Valley is one segment of the 81-mile 81 81 Pocahontas Trail from Pokagon State Park in Angola following the state, the Obachi State Park in Bluffton. This bridge is possible because of a $5 million gift from the Van Family Foundation to the city. And the total project is expected to cost about $10 million. Don Ritchie says that the rest of that money is expected to come up from grants and any donations that will come in during and throughout the bidding process that's expected to begin in 2025. Reporting live from Coliseum Boulevard, I'm Avery Johnson with Box 55 News. Avery.